Hello scholars. In this problem, we're given a table with the first time and the second time, or as defined, the elapsed time. And this goes back to our formula that we've been talking about all unit long, which is our final time minus our initial time is equal to our elapsed time. So let's get started. Starting from problem number one, 1115 minus 825, when we subtract, we can't subtract 25 from 15, so we have to borrow an hour. And this becomes a 75, because we add 60 to it to borrow the hour. 75 minus 25 is 50, and 10 minus 8 is 2. So it should be 2 hours and 50 minutes. OK? I'm going to erase this, and we're going to go on to problem number 2. In problem number 2, we have our second time was 3.18. And our starting time was 1.30. Same principle here. We had to borrow an hour. So this is 78. 78 minus 30 is 48. And, well, I made a mistake. It's 2 minus 1. It's not 3 minus 1 anymore. 2 minus 1 is 148. Let's go on to problem number 3. Problem number 3. We see that our ending time is 10.05. Our starting time is 3.45. Once again, we have to borrow another hour. So this becomes a 65. 65 minus 45 is 20. And 9 minus 3 is 6. So we have 6.20. And moving on. This one's a little bit more complicated, but that makes it more fun, right? So this is 2. 05 and 1044. Notice that 205 is the later time because it's p.m. It is in the afternoon, whereas this one is a.m. in the morning. Don't get confused and put the bigger number first. So if this is p.m. and this is a.m., we're going to have a lot of problems real quickly when we try to subtract the hours. So I'm going to go ahead and add 12 hours here to change this back into 24 hour time. So borrowing an hour. Right? So 65 minus 44, I think that's equal to 21. Check my math. And 13 minus 10 is equal to 3. So it should be 3 hours and 21 minutes. Notice here that I had to borrow 12 hours from the morning because this is in the afternoon. And the last problem that we have is 635 minus 12.06. Now, since both of these are PM, and by the way, this should be pretty easy right here. 35 minus 6, that should be 29. But here's the difficult part. 6 PM and 12 PM. 12 PM, really, you can think of it as 0, right? Because honestly, that's what it is. We're talking about 12 PM. Otherwise, you can add 12 hours to this to make sure that you can subtract easily enough. So that should be 6 hours and 29 minutes.